I'm Richard, and I want to welcome you back to Push-Ups for PTSD, Day 1596, where I'm looking to raise awareness for post-traumatic stress disorder and mental health organizations. Along with talking about today, I have motivational quotes throughout the video. Before I say anything else, there are two things I'd like you to comment below. First, an idea for the next incentive goal. Second, do you have a charity you'd like me to focus on for February that deals with PTSD or mental health? Day 24 for the month and day 3 for the new 10 day goal to raise awareness and maybe some donations for wounded warriors. We're doing okay on our goals but not quite meeting them at the moment. Please do all you feel comfortable with to help spread awareness. And please drop a comment with what you'd like as an incentive if we meet the 10 day awareness goal. I found that with depression, one of the most important things you can realize is that you're not alone. You're not the first to go through it, and you're not going to be the last to go through it. Remember, every day is a battle, but you've made it this far, which means every day has been a victory so far. You're undefeated against yourself, so keep going. I understand your pain. Trust me, I do. I've seen people go from the darkest moments in their lives to living a happy, wonderful life. You can do it too. I believe in you. You're not a burden. You will never be a burden. It's a quote by Sophie Turner. Next, I want you to know that I am here for you. You're not alone. You are worthy and deserving of love and respect. And you don't need to apologize for your illness. There are treatments available. Please seek help if you need it. I do have links and phone numbers in the description below to services around the world. The charity of the month, if you haven't heard yet, is Wounded Warriors Canada. Half of anything I make will go to help them and their practices. Wounded Warriors Canada is a national mental health service provider utilizing clinical best practices and evidence informed care to create an environment of compassion, resiliency, and hope for Canada's veterans, first responders, and their families. There is hope, even when your brain tells you there isn't. That's a quote by John Green. Today's sets were pretty difficult. I started off with my medium strength resistance band, and partway through the second uh, set, I knew that I had made my task for the day pretty hard. Despite, despite dropping down to the lowest resistance band for the last four sets, none of them were smooth. At least I know that this way I got a pretty good workout in. If you ever feel like life is too much for you right now, make sure you turn to friends, family, professionals, or even random YouTubers for help. It's never too late to ask, and there's an abundance of people out there more than willing to provide whatever help they can. The code word today is love, because that's what my daughter chose. If you'd like to donate to the monthly charity and my efforts, please visit my Patreon page. I hope you're all doing well. Take care of yourselves. Stay safe, stay strong, and most importantly, thank you for surviving. And if you've never seen one before and you want to see a Korean at two times spicy fire noodle challenge, check out my other video. Have a great day.